hello guys and welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be kind of like a vlog style type of video like getting ready for the summer i have a grocery haul to share with you guys a huge grocery haul to share with you guys other things that i need to buy for the kiddos and for the home because they are going to be home all day and so i wanted to get some snacks and stuff um ready for them to be home and to be able to grab and to feed themselves throughout the you know the time that we're at home all day Plus, I have some things that I want to do to get ready for the summer. I want to plan our, you know, what activities we want to do as a family. So I want to share with you guys kind of like the little paper that I have in my planner where we plan out our activities for the summertime and kind of give you ideas as well. Um, and then you guys can also give me some ideas in the comments down below what you guys are doing this summer. I also have some new things that I've purchased that I want to share with you guys for the home that I think you guys might like that it's affordable. Some of them is summer things. Some of them are just things for the home to keep, you know, the house fresh and smelling good. But also, I do have some new cleaning products that I have. I have a new vacuum that mops and um, vacuums up as well that I absolutely love. I want to share that with you guys. And a new steamer that I'm using as well that I just purchased. I saw everybody on Instagram and TikTok using it. So I've been using it for a while and I want to actually clean out the snack drawer that I have in my refrigerator to get it ready for all the snacks and the fruits and stuff that I bought for the kiddos with that huge grocery haul. So you'll see me clean that. So this video is going to be a little bit of everything. It's going to be, you know, a grocery haul, some cleaning motivation, just taking you around our day. We might get in the pool. I'm going to share with you guys my pool if you haven't seen it already, our pool and kind of some of the things that we're already doing for summer and getting ready for summer. So just come along with me today and it's going to be a vlog style kind of summer get it all done with me. So this is a huge haul. So I have things not only on this counter, but I also have things on this counter as well. And don't mind the mess in the background because I need to, you know, get stuff cleaned up. But this is a huge haul and I also have the meats sitting here in the sink because they were, you know, kind of wet and stuff like that. And I don't want them to be like wet and stuff all over my counter. So let me just share with you the chickens first. So right here we have some chicken wings that we're going to make for Friday, some buffalo um wings and so we got this kind we've never got this kind before but the prices on everything has gone up so much and this was only 2.98 a pound and everything else was like 4.98 a pound or 6.66 a pound when it came to chicken wings so we decided to get these these are just the flats but um i think no actually these are the flat they're connected so yeah these are the ones that are connected which we don't mind so but they were actually cheaper it was 2.98 a pound so if you don't want to spend that 6.68 or 6.56 whatever it was a pound get these from walmart they're only 2.98 a pound and then i also got me some leg quarters again i told you guys it's like um only like five something a bag and so um they kind of went up because they used to be like under it was around four dollars but now it's around five dollars so it's kind of like 50 something cents a pound so that's a good deal so these leg quarters are huge you guys saw me um share them with you guys before when i prepped my video um, when i did my meal prep and they're really big and they are so juicy we have um eaten them and they are juicy i will never go back to any other ones this is actually really good so let's start back here we have my husband's milk and then also my creamer that i got i also got two things of these toaster scrambles i love these and for some reason they've been out of stock especially the one i used to get is the one is the french toast one which is my favorite but it's been out of stock in my store so i made sure to grab two of these this time because they're always out of stock Got some chips for the girls, um, some Pringles, um, Doritos for my oldest daughter and my husband, some hot fries, my Dorito um, ones, the spicy ones that I love. These are so good, but they give you heartburn, but I, I love them. Um, sunflower seeds. Had to get some more um, dishwashing soap, which this one's my favorite. This is the Great Value brand one. I like these. I like this one um, against any other name brand one. Um, because it doesn't leave streaks or spots on my dishes and when I use the cascade one before and another one They they always leave like spots and this one doesn't I also got these little ego french toast minis. My oldest one loves these and I got some shrimp for a a salad kind of like a ceviche kind of pico de gallo type of Salsa that I make I'm going to share that with you guys and I always add these little shrimps in it It's so easy to just add them in it because it's already cooked I got the big bag of the breakfast sausages for the family. They love them. And then I got me a small little pack of turkey sausages for me. I got some fries for when we have the chicken wings. We can have some fries. And since we have an air fryer, um, the girls love to make fries on their own. So I had to get another bag of fries. I got some bacon for breakfast for dinner night, which is tonight. And also for just to have... Um, during the week and my family loves the regular bacon, I'm actually eating my turkey bacon. Like I said, I'm trying to get better 
with my fitness goals and eating better and I just like to swap out things so for me I like to have turkey um, substitutions when I can so I'll get the turkey sausages for breakfast and also the turkey bacon and I love it got some hot dogs for the kids so they can make easy lunches I also got two packs of this um, mozzarella string cheese for the girls to have as snacks but also I wanted to make some mozzarella sticks for me and now that I have the air fryer it's even you know easier and faster to make it for me like the homemade ones so I got two bags so I can make some mozzarella sticks for me and the hubby but also just for the girls to snack on I got some strawberries these are um, some more I'm actually gonna pick up some more when I go to the other store because I have to get some more stuff some avocado for the pico de gallo um, kind of ceviche salsa and also some limes over here, I picked up some tortilla chips for that pico, pico de gallo kind of ceviche sauce I'm going to make. I usually get the bite-sized ones, but they were out of that one, so I decided to get these. Um, they said they're like a little bit more skinnier and um, lighter, um, but they all, this, this bag came so crumpled up. Like this order, for some reason, usually I don't have complaints about my pickup orders, but for some reason they bagged this so wrongly and it was just horrible. Um, so that's why I have to go back to the store and get some more stuff um, that they damaged and I had to do for a refund and also some stuff that they didn't have. I also picked up some light Greek yogurt. Um, I got these for me and my husband, but my youngest actually likes this too, which I'm happy about. So we got the two of those. I also got some damn animals for the girls. They really like that. And then I got two things of bread. One I'm going to um, put in the pantry, one I'm going to freeze. For them to make sandwiches i got some hot dog buns for the hot dogs i also got three different kinds of the you know toaster pastries you know the great value um pop tarts so we got cherry strawberry and then we also got the cookies and cream one and my girls they they you can eat these for breakfast that's what they're for but my girls like them for like dessert and they're like to me there's like more sugary they're more like a dessert so it's kind of like a snack cake for them of course we had to stock up on ramen you can never go wrong with ramen for like quick dinners lunches and so that's great to have for the kiddos for the summertime had to stock up on the peanut butter and jelly so that they can make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches so i got two each of those we are going to be making a lot of like different types of spaghettis or lasagnas i'm actually going to um do some freezer meals and some um quick meals to make ahead so stay tuned for that video because i don't want to be in the kitchen all summer i want to enjoy the summer with the kiddos so i got four cans of these because sometimes for some reason things have been going out you know out of stock and so whenever i see something i'm i'm stocking up on them because i want to have them on hand so i got four cans of the hunts for cheeses which is our favorite i also got some marinara sauce and the great value one i got two jars of that for when we make the mozzarella sticks so it's like you know mozzarella sticks are little snacks to have appetizers or just something to binge watch from the tv i got two things of eggs um you guys know that i like to if you guys watch my channel i like to boil one pack and then have one pack regular so that i can have the boiled ones on hand at any time we want it i got some spaghetti noodles which i'm glad these came back in stock this was out of stock for a while for some reason the pasta was gone from um, walmart and so i saw these and this one is a four pack and you actually get a better deal when you buy this one it's cheaper by the bag so i got um four of those and spaghetti is one of those quick meals that you can make during the summertime that you can either add meatballs to it um, you can add sausages to it you can add shrimp to it chicken whatever so you can always uh, make it differently for your family if they get tired of it but it's uh, one of my go-to meals is spaghetti so if you're ever in a quick pinch and you need an idea just spaghetti um, we got the buffalo wing sauce for the buffalo wings that we're going to make and that we love sweet baby ray's barbecue barbecue sauce and we definitely love their buffalo wing sauce if you haven't tried the sauce guys you have to try it it's so good got some more canola oil spray and butter spray because we ran out um, and then i also stocked up on some breadcrumbs because for the mozzarella sticks but also um i have some meals coming up again like i told you guys so stay tuned for that so i had to stock up on it so i got some regular breadcrumbs and some regular um, plain panko crumbs i like using a mixture of both and so I got the regular one, but I also got the Italian style ones for when we do the mozzarella sticks or whenever I do like an Italian type of meal. And then I also got some grated Parmesan because my husband likes that for the spaghetti and all that other stuff. But this is all we have for this haul. And then we're about to go to the store, the other store to get some more stuff. I also wanted to share with you guys this thing I found at Walmart. So you guys know I'm going to be doing some projects around the house, like redoing my laundry room and the bathroom. And so I had to get some more paint supplies and I had to get a couple things that came in this little kit. So I saw this little kit at Walmart for only 20 bucks. So I decided just to grab this kit and it's from Better Homes and Garden. And so if you're ever doing like a painting project and you need to start from scratch or even if you need to get like I had to get the tape, I had to get some paint brushes, I had to get the drop cloth. 
it all comes in here and it gives you like extra brushes that you need because I also wanted to get some extra brushes. Um, these brushes I actually needed for me, but then I also wanted to get some extra ones so that my daughter, my youngest one, she always likes to help. So in case she wants to help, she has one for herself as well. So this little kit just comes with a lot for just 20 bucks. And then the fact that it's like Better Homes and Garden, which Better Homes and Garden is always like kind of more expensive than like the Great Value brand. So I thought this was a great deal. So I wanted to share it with you guys, all the stuff that you can get. And it's in the painting section. Whenever you get like all the, the paint supplies and stuff like that, they have it there. So definitely check it out if you guys are doing a project this summer. A painting project like I'm doing and you need to get a bunch of things at a good price okay so the rest of the stuff that we got at the other Walmart was just these little like yogurts they come with like M&Ms and Oreos so we got the big box for my youngest and my hubby because they like to eat that and then I also got some of these squeezy varieties they didn't have the unsweetened applesauce ones that we want so we'll get those next time um, but I got those and then I also got some breakfast sandwiches for my youngest as well I also got some women's vitamins multivitamins i need to look up uh, the things that i need because i know that there's more vitamins that i need to take you know that i'm about to hit 40 and so if you guys know like where you can do like a survey or like something where you can figure out what vitamins you need to take let me know in the comments down below because i need to find out like exactly the vitamins i need to take and then also we got a skillet um one of those cast iron skillets we've been wanting it for a while so we got one we got the great value brand um, also, if you have tips on how to clean these, I know it's like a special way to keep these things clean. Let me know in the comments down below because it's the first time we had a cast iron skillet. But I am going to show you guys how I make kind of like the ceviche uh, pico de gallo type of salsa right now because I'm eating it for lunch. And then we are going to put all this stuff away. Well, we're going to put the snack stuff away in the snack jar. I mean the snack drawer and I'm actually going to clean it out with the steamer that I'm gonna share with you guys as well. Okay, so for that shrimp ceviche or kind of like, it's a, it's a pico de gallo and then I add shrimp to it. What I like to do is I use this little cocktail shrimp that I share with you guys in the grocery haul. I also, this time I'm gonna use fresh tomatoes. Normally I just use like the can of diced tomatoes and sometimes I'll get the one that already has the jalapenos in it. But um, for this recipe, I actually want to use fresh tomatoes because I had them on hand. So I want to use those before they go bad. So I'll just save this for something else. But I also add some purple onion in it. I add avocado, some lime juice. You can add a jalapeno, but I'm going to use some crushed red pepper flake because that's what I like in mine. And then normally I also add cilantro to it, but I don't have any on hand. So that's the only thing that's not going to be in it. And so I'm going to get started on this, show you guys how I make it. But first I'm going to wash and rinse these strawberries and get them prepped and ready to put in the refrigerator.
Okay, so here's the little steamer that I was telling you guys about that I've seen like all over TikTok and on Instagram. Everybody's using it. So I had to get it. I actually got mine at Walmart and it came in this beautiful like blue teal color, which you guys know is like my favorite color. Well, one of my favorite colors is that and baby pink. And so I got this and it comes in this box like this. Um, I've already used it for my shower. It works really good. It got out a stain that 
I can never get out with brushes and it got it out really easy. Um, it comes with this tube right here, it's still in the plastic, um, so I haven't used it yet because it attaches here so you can make it longer, kind of like a vacuum. And then it comes with all these different like brushes. Um, you can see it right here on the, on the box right here, all the different brushes that it comes with, which is amazing because this brush right here it comes in three different colors. It's the same brush, but you can use it for different parts of your house. So it's, um, I'm gonna have one like for the kitchen, for the bathrooms, and like, I guess, outdoors. And I like it that it comes with like three different ones so that you're not cross-contaminating anything, especially if you're using your bathroom. And then it comes with this long one. And actually, let me just take it out the bag, doing everything one-handed. But, so here's the, the three that come um, in the three different colors. So like I said, I'm gonna use this one for the outside. This one's gonna be for the bathrooms, the green one, and the red one I'm gonna use for the kitchen. So I'm gonna use it to scrub out the inside of my refrigerator if I need it. They also have this little one where you can get in the crevices of anything. And a lot of people were using this in the refrigerator to get into those spots that was kind of hard to get under the glass. It was helping um, the steam can get underneath it with this little like, um, I don't know what they call it, this little like piece. I don't know what it's called, but anyways, this little piece uh, attachment. There we go, attachment. It also has this little scraper right here where the steam will come out here and you can use this as a scraper. This one they said was for gum. And this one's really cool. It's really skinny to get into like those little skinny spots and stuff. So like I said, I've already used it on my bathroom and I love it. I'm going to try it out on the refrigerator um, snack drawer because it's really messy. So you guys will see that. And then we're gonna try this out to get like all the gunk out. Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Chemicals collide Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight Dripping lights paint the sky
Okay, so don't mind the table because it's really dusty and I need to like clean it. But I got this thing from Five and Below. It's like a floating wireless speaker. So we're going to try it out. Hopefully I don't have to charge it or anything because I haven't done that yet. So um, let me open it up. And I hope that the sun is hitting like really bright right now. So hopefully my camera is doing what it needs to do and giving y'all what y'all need to do because it's just you know trying to work with the sun and sometimes the sun can mess up the cameras okay so i had that upside down so it comes you have to blow up the, the little flamingo so brown you want to blow up the flam flamingo and then here's a little speaker here and so i'm going to read the instructions and then i'll come back so this is how it looks it's actually pretty big it's really cute and it's already fully charged and i've already hooked it up to my phone so we're about to go try it out and have some fun in the pool for a little bit and then come back inside so i was gonna get in with Bray. But then Mother Nature came. As soon as I went to go change, I noticed that something came. And so I wasn't able to get in with Bree. So she's actually in the pool right now. And we're just watching her. Um, so we're going to see how this little floaty um, speaker works. And I'm really mad because I really wanted to get in the pool. But at least I can give you guys some shots of the pool and to show you like how the pool looks and stuff like that. Because if I was in the water, I wouldn't be able to do that. Um, I'm recording on my phone right now because I don't trust my camera around the water and I don't trust me around my camera in the water. So um, if it looks different on video, it's because I did switch to my my camera phone. So yeah, I'm gonna give you some shots of the pool, Brianna playing in it, and um, I will let you know after we've tried the speaker, the Flamingo speaker, if it works, if it's worth your buy to go to Five and Below and get it. So guys, even though the Flamingo was really cute, it actually didn't work very well. It was very low. It started to get even lower as we were using it and it kept cutting off and disconnecting from my phone. So I don't suggest buying this, you know, spend a little bit more and get something else. But this was definitely something I am going to return. Now, after this, my cramps got so bad and my lovely husband decided to just take us out for IHOP instead of me making breakfast for dinner night that night. So I was super excited that I didn't have to cook. So we went to IHOP after this. And so that's why I decided to end this video. But don't worry, stay tuned for the next video where I will share with you guys the vacuum and the other things that I bought for the summertime and you know, give you guys some clean ideas. And I also have some summer DIYs coming your way. So definitely put those notifications on and stay tuned for the next video. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye guys.